Hello, everybody. Say hello. Hello. <laughs> Where are you? I'm from here. Where are you? You're riding on my shoulders. Yeah. So we found out that mm -hmm. even I have a huge pack, huh? there's still space on my shoulders for a little guy. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Next question is, how long can Daddy walk with a little man on his shoulders? Thing. Depends on me. Depends on him. So when he gets strong again, he's going to walk again. Yeah. All right. We are currently walking on a beach. Let me show you. Now uh, these are sick dogs. Uh, you can tell by the uh, wobble in their feet and the look on their face that they, uh, they're they not really that into going out on the sub. But, looks cool. Now you can hear me up here, but we're about seven kilometers in. How are you feeling? Yeah, good, but pretty tired. Good, but pretty tired. Seven kilometers from Sushi Marina gets you over here, and actually, if you look in the background, and I can see Anoshima, which is about 20 kilometers from here. Liking it? Yeah. Loving it? Yeah. Loving it, loving it, loving it? Yeah. Right, where are we going next? Yeah. That way. All right, let's see what this little guy has got. So, this is my, I guess, my first test for the Osmo Pocket. And, but it's not only a test for the Osmo Pocket, it's kind of a test for vlogging while hiking around Japan or running around Japan or hiking around Japan, any of those good things. And uh, it's also a mic test because this is the mic of the Pocket. There's no external mic, which I think will be a problem because I'm running through the sea. And I'm also testing out not only... Where's he looking? What's he doing? Come back to me, baby. All right. So I'm also testing not only my ability to walk with like a big pack, 15 kilos, but also this little guy's ability to find him. There he is. This, this little guy is also trying to do the hike, right? And how, how are you enjoying it? Yeah, quite hard, but it's my friend. And where, where are we now? It looks like you're about to jump into the sea or something. Not right now, but I'm gonna jump into the sea. Pretty beautiful, huh? Uh huh. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh. The end. Actually, the water's beautiful here. It's kind of like a green turquoise color. And uh, it's a bit windy, so it's a bit choppy. It's a perfect day for being out on your, on your boat. There's a lot of sailboats out there. It's one guy in a rowing boat, which you don't see very often. And there's a guy swimming butterfly over there. Uh, this beach is just down from Hayama and the much more popular Zushi Beach. And in my opinion, it's so much nicer here because it just doesn't get the crowds. Actually, the last station around here is Zushi Station. That's why everybody heads to Kamakura and Zushi Beaches. But once you get down here where you need a, a car or a bus, it's much nicer. And these guys know it. Katie, you want to see? Yeah, <laughs> Katie! Thank you.
Yeah.